my guys, girls, gamers, and gamies. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. Today we are back with more LEGO Fortnite Hardcore Survival. But instead of Hardcore Survival, you know what it is. It is part two to last video where we built the Beachside Boulevard Bundle Builds. Now, in previous episodes before, I built the Durburger Restaurant. If you haven't seen those builds or that video, y'all go check that out. And if you haven't seen the last video, y'all make sure to check that out and then come right back. As you can see, we are finishing up the Beachside Boulevard builds because we only have three left. Today, we are going to be making the Beach Pavilion, the Beach House, and the Little Beach House. Or Lil. Lil. Lil Beach House. Uh, I've got enough granite and I've got enough wood. And I, I think we're ready to go. Uh, as well as me getting the the bright agent skin which was a part of a you know just a little like three like 349 thing like in the item shop so if that's still in the item shop for you y'all go check that out if y'all want to go get that i got it because i knew that i like, i felt i felt obligated to get these like these new skins so i could show them off to you as well as a new skin that's gonna be showing up later on sometime down the future as well as whatever the new playstation skin is that they've included for this current season. But that's the plan for today. I will be showing you all some new decor. And we're just going to have fun. So if you all enjoy this video and want to see more videos like this. Let me know down in the comments below. Make sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure to share this with your friends. Share this with your family. Share this with whoever. Make sure notifications are turned on so you never miss any one of my videos when they go up. Also if you want to see these videos early and feel like becoming a member. Y'all go check out the join button on my channel. Now, let's get into it. I, first off, I think my character is broken for some reason. Her head is still, like, is tilted to the left. Like, I can't fix it. Like, it's not, it's not changing. Because if I look this way, she's just looking in that. I think her neck's broken. <laughs> I don't know what happened, but I think her neck is broken. Like, I don't know what to do about that. But I'm going to start off... Probably with the beach pavilion. Now, I've pondered where I want to put this, and I was waiting to see what y'all had in the comments, but I'm going to put this out in the water as kind of a an idea of mine, just to uh, see how this would work. So, I'm, it's basically setting up a bridge out into uh, into the water. And maybe I can build it out towards that island, or this... Would you call that an island? I don't even know what you'd call that. But we're going to start working on this. It should look good, hopefully. I mean, it's not exactly far out into the water. Oops, sorry, I hiccup. Uh, I think it would work going into the water. I just have to play some, uh, play some flat uh, wood planks and go further out. Or I could probably place multiple... Uh, beach pavilions and just build straight out that could work too I could honestly see that working that would be uh, interesting but this after this video I think like we'll head back to the desert for the for the rest of the hardcore series we'll head to the desert which again I have upgraded my village some not the whole way uh, just so I didn't cheat y'all out of some have some uh, videos I still got to upgrade most of it it'll be done soon once we're finished up with the desert village though we will start moving our way towards the winter or frost biome depending on what you want to call it and I think we've got some pretty good work there but I can't help but feel like I'd rather stick with the creative side of things and just do whatever builds they need to start doing like Kind of like what they just did, and I'll show you right here. Uh, you know, Bright Bomber has her own bed. Like all this new, like new stuff. I don't. I, that's a nightstand. Like I'm, I can't wait to do the decor stuff for the interior sides of all these houses. Like I'll do it for every single one if I have to. But I just think all this looks really cool. Ooh, I like that. That's. I, all this stuff is really cool, but they need to include more places, in my opinion. A bright vanity mirror? Cool. Okay, planter. Somewhere I saw a fan. I don't know if it was... I think it was for this character. Like She has 
or maybe it was just the way the bundle thing looked. It said it, there was like a mirror, or not a mirror, a window. Not either one of those. I'm a fan. God. Uh, I don't know if the fan's in this. I don't know if they even have a working fan, which would be kind of cool, though. It probably just uh, moves around really slowly, almost like it was in like a Fallout game, which I haven't even played Fallout in so long. Last Fallout thing I did was like Fallout Shelter, and if you haven't seen those videos, y'all go check those out. I have, I've done a lot of stuff in my past time. One more stage to please tell me it's not the top. How do you expect me to get up there? Dad, gummit, you have me going up top, but I'm more of a bottom. What? Why? What? The heck? Okay, neither one of those go there. I'm confused. Okay, you see this, right? Neither one of those objects work. Or am I just too far? How can the game do that to me when I'm not even right next to it? You know what? Thank... I'm so glad that they've made that the way it works, just so I don't have to... Ugh. Actually, I want to see if I can start it out first. Like, is there a... Oh, it's not even in the water. <laughs> yeah, no, that did not... Well, I'm curious, can we... It's not going to go far enough. Ooh, we might be able to. That... That might work. Ooh. I want to go one up, please. That might be it, but I'm not going to do that. That just seems dumb. It is somewhat in the water, though. I'll take that. It looks nice. Now, uh, last episode, I did say I would rate these. That, I'll, I'll get to that in a minute. I can already tell a problem with it. And it's probably just based on where I placed it, and that's on me. Next, depending on which one costs more. It doesn't even say. Wait, where does it say how many... Hold on, it used to say how many stages it would take. Because I remember seeing it said... Hmm... 31 stages, there we go. 50, 54 stages, Jesus. Hmm. That's alright, no problem here. Now, I want to build this little beach house, like, somewhere more along the water. Side right here, but not far enough. So, for anyone wondering why I have this on a lake, like I explained in the last video, if you're new here, uh... Instead of, like, trips and stuff, I would typically do more, like, lake trips with my family. And this almost makes more sense for me to do, like, a lake resort-style build design, which I kind of love. It lo it makes sense to me. Uh, now, depending on where, like, y'all feel like y'all put this, I could see this going in, like, at the desert. Not, well, the oasis area of the desert, yes. Uh, you just put, like, one of these there. I could see that being a thing, which sounds pretty cool. But I, I could also, I would, I also need to test this out at a beach, which would be kind of cool. I finally found the like the uh, the bills that re represent this place in the current season of uh, Fortnite. Which for anyone that's watching this in the future, that would be Chapter Five, Season Two. I'm pretty sure. I think this is Season Two of Chapter Five. It's, we, I, I hate that we have to call them either chapter, like, chapter something, then seasons. It's like, it used to just be a season one, like, it used to just be seasons, and then they, everything got changed. Which I've gone over with my friends about, like, all the new stuff. There, like, there is no story with the game anymore. I, if anyone knows the exact story of what's going on, y'all might have to tell me. Because I, I feel like I've been left out of the, of the story because I just don't get it anymore because of doing that them doing the myths and mortals stuff none of it makes sense to me at least I feel like no one cares about the story anymore 
because it is more battle royale. Like everyone just cares more about the battle royale. I feel like. But for some pl people, y'all y'all care more about this, which I really like. This, for me, this almost feels like the new Minecraft. Like this game has become insanely popular, and I'm I'm mainly talking about just Lego Fortnite, not Fortnite at all. Um, even though that game is popular, I'm just talking about the uh, Lego Fortnite as a whole. It's it's got elements of different games, which is nice, but you also get to have the Fortnite characters in the game, which you know. I don't know which one my favorite would be. You know, I want to hear from y'all. What would be, like, y'all's top three? Like, if y'all could rock any skin, which ones would y'all rock, like, just daily? Just for fun. If I had to, if I had to put my guess... You know, I'm a fan of the Drift skin. That was the first uh, Battle Pass that I bought that included Drift. And I, I, I like that skin. I wish they could include, like, the different outfits that he has but that's just me that would be nice though for lego uh for lego styles to have different where did that go where did that go uh, did that place i hope that didn't place anywhere i don't know what i did i really hope i didn't mess that up was that not the right piece Maybe I was stepping... Oh, that might be why. Maybe I was, like, in the spot. Because I was like, why can't I find this? Why wasn't it placing? I got so confused. But no, back to what I was saying. Drift skin, probably one of my favorites. As far as who I put at 2 and 3, I don't know. Uh, I guess it really depends on, like, what looks cool and what just makes sense. To me, like what has because I really like something with a lot of detail. And yes, I know I'm hungry, I'll eat in a second once I, I finish that stage. I got a lot of corn, and I feel like I've given up on my garden. Uh, for many of y'all that know, I've been trying to find fertilizer in this game, this version of her of the Lego Fortnite, so I can make a garden. But I have no animals in this world because I said it that way. And it's kind of difficult because I haven't even found fertilizer in the chest. What's weird is I've found like wool and like stuff that like wool and milk, things that are coming like come, that come from the animals. But yet you, you, like, there's no fertilizer whatsoever. So either I haven't found the right chest yet. Or there's just not going to be any in this version of the game. Which would really suck, you know? Because I, I want to have a garden. That just... Because in this world, food matters a lot now. Because I'm doing it on a, on a hardcore level. Which I don't think they've changed the settings at all. Like I don't think they've added any additional settings that you can make for your world. But, you know, I've kind of had an idea of maybe doing a... Uh, a, a, uh, a sandbox world and just goofing around and seeing what like, what kind of stupid crap I can make, which sounds fun. I made a YouTube short on it. Just uh, I called it pure dumb fun. Like just it was just a dumb moment. It was me putting a a bunch of chickens on a dynamic foundation and putting a balloon in the middle, sending it sky high, and then putting uh, thrusters around it and watching the thing go. Uh, like around, like just spinning. It was hilarious. At least when I did it, it was hilarious. I don't know. I have a, I have a lot of fun with this game because you can just kind of do anything that you can put your mind to, and that's all that matters. You gotta have creativity. And I think that goes there. Nope. I don't like that they have to do this though, where you have to have two different sods. Like, it should all just be the same build. It shouldn't be... I don't know. That's just me. So that would probably go there. Alright. Oh, and it's already night time. I hate doing this at night because you can't see a whole lot. But maybe once we finish up, we might be able to get this done to uh, daytime. I like the little beach house. It's, so it's... Hold on. 
Okay. So, would this be more of a front? Th- no, it makes more sense for this going out towards the water. That just makes more sense. Now, I think there is a backside to this. There is. I can see that as a. Uh, it's almost like a backyard, if you will, which I I don't hate. It looks nice. Now, if we go inside, and I'll give all these a rating at the end. Very s- small on the inside, sure. But you have this nice room. Could be a, for a yeah. This could be a bedroom. I could see that. Uh, in here, you have kind of more of your living room situation. You know, a TV maybe. Man, imagine if they put a TV in this. That'd be funny. Now up here, I can see having more like maybe some stations or a chest. Maybe a. Ch- I don't have the planks on me right now, but you could definitely have a chest right here, which feels very Fortnite lock to do that. So I can see that. That could work. I don't know. I like it. Out of all of these, oh, I, I and again, I'll get to that in a minute. I may have to one day rebuild that. We will see. I just don't like that there, oddly enough. But I think I don't think I have an, exactly enough. How much am I lacking? A whole stack of fifty. Good thing I have plenty wood in my chest. That is probably going to get taken out of context. I apologize. That was not intended. Uh, okay. Now all I gotta do is build one more build, and we're good to go. Actually, I before I do this, okay, that's just gonna cost regular wood. Wood. Okay, so I might actually make some decor as well. Make the houses look pretty. For some reason. Actually, well, yeah, I'll do that with the one flopper. Because I asked y'all in the last video, uh, and I don't think anyone had said anything about the fish. But I'm going to make the uh, the hanging fish on one of the walls. I think it's going to look good. Oh, yeah. Now, yes, I know I'm not using the wood method of taking the wood tools and fighting the mo mobs. I will do that. Right now, I'm just trying to build. I feel attacked. I feel like they're like they're specifically going after me. There's no one else. That's what's like no other mobs to Now I'm not saying have friendly NPCs, but I'm saying mobs need to sometimes fight each other just randomly. Like that that's how they make mob like these enemies in every game. It's almost like they they won't fight each other unless they actually hit each other. Which Somewhat makes sense, but it's like, but then again, you are the protagonist. You are the the hero of the story. And Dad Gummit, I see you. Find me over here. This is my turf. Ow! I am rocking my three hearts for today, just for this video. But yeah, now call me crazy, but for anyone that's played the Friday the Thirteenth game. And I know I'm name dropping here, but that so because I couldn't help but want to place these. I couldn't help but think of the uh, the intro to how every uh, game of those go. Like when you start a matchup in Friday the Thirteenth, they do these little cut scenes at the very beginning of uh, Jason getting his first um, elimination, if you want to call it. Yeah, I, I uh, that this place just resembles that. In a weird way. I haven't even watched those movies, oddly enough. I'm not a big horror guy. But I like the little beach house. I think that's going to be good. I'm going to place... Come here. Ow. Yeah, also skeletons swim now, for anyone that didn't know that. I figured I'd share that little tidbit with you. <sighs> now all I need is one more build. One more build to finish it off, and then we can start working on our desert uh, man, uh, desert stuff so we can get all these done. And then I still got to finish the Pleasant Park builds. We've got so many builds to go through just for these giant villages. What? How did I, okay. I thought I grabbed enough. Apparently I didn't grab enough. I'm either blind or stupid, and I don't think I'm blonde. So I think I must be stupid. 
<laughs> okay, should have enough. I think we're good to go. We're going to end this episode off on a on a bright sunny day. Literally when I got on it was storming and the rain and lightning was lasting like it lasted for like 5 minutes and then it wasn't stopping. So I had to leave and then come back. Um I kind of have an idea of where I want this. I'm just curious if it'll let me. So I know this is very out and random. Ah, oh, that gum spider! You messing with my builds? Oh. Um. You know, I want to place a house here. Crap! Shit! Wait a minute. You're f coming further this way. I can't fight you though, not yet. I have to abide by my rules. Okay. We're gonna make a beach house here. I, I, that's a, it's a bad idea. You know what? More the merrier, you know? Like, you gotta throw caution to the wind. I, I swear. That, ugh, it may one day break my builds. I'm scared for that now. I didn't even realize there was one nearby. So I gotta be very careful not to piss him off. Hey, I'm hey, I'm not here to cause any trouble, okay? I'm just here to build a house. I'm I'm here to do what I've been contracted to do. I'm just a worker. Please, I don't get paid enough. Please leave me. Leave me alone. Spare me. Don't no. Not not today. Please, not today. Not on my recording day. Maybe later, but not now. <laughs> not when I'm... Oh, God. Well, remember how I was saying that the mobs should fight each other? I think they were doing that just now. I, I manifested that. I... Ike. I just ask... What well, I just asked the universe to do something for me and it listens. I don't know why I spot I for some reason I thought the spider was there. <sighs> Come on. Let's have at it. You gotta remember I'm in three hearts. Give me your meat. Okay. Now we should be in for a nice relaxing video. Just the rest of the way through, we're fine. No, no problems. Just happy little Happy little accidents. Nice fluffy clouds up in the sky. <sighs> I gotta say, this one might be the the big one for me. I might like end up enjoying this as my main house. We'll see. I picked this place not only because it resembles my previous village when I did Lego Fortnite with friends with Cameron, but it does make for a nice like a nice place. Like, just nice around the lake. Having... Oh, well, no, then... I may have done that wrong. I may have... I should have probably flipped the houses, but I feel like this would work. Imagine... Man, I can... Y'all don't want to even want to know what I can imagine with this game. So, right out of the gate, I can imagine... Them making, like, a certain part of the world, like... Just imagine if they did, like, city streets and everything. Like, you had streets that you could build cities around. And you just built in those, like, areas. And you made an actual, just an actual city. And you can have, like... I, I'm imagining way too much. Like, I'm almost picturing GTA, but for... Needs to, oh, I see what you mean now. Gotcha. That, oh, that's why I, it didn't place earlier, I think. Maybe I'm or I'm just dumb again. But this seem, this one takes the longest out of all of one, out of all of them, and I don't know whether or not this is one of the longest builds that they've had. Please leave me alone. Otherwise, I'm going to have to resort to violence, and I don't want to have to resort to violence. That would just that would that would just make me a brute, and you're the brute. You see how that works? So don't don't mess with me. 
Whew. Okay. Now I'm curious. Did if anyone bought these like this these new the the new stuff for the game? Y'all let me know because I can see how some of y'all didn't. If y'all didn't, just because it's not entirely worth them, because it should be a part of the game. But that's why I bought it, so you didn't have to. So uh, that way, I could just show it off for you, and let y'all see, like y'all let y'all experience the fun. And y'all may end up seeing me fight a brute in this episode w via uh, via uh, construction stoppage because it's getting real close. It's getting real close. As long as I don't have to fight it, I think I'm good for today. I wasn't looking for a fight. I just wanted to. I just wanted to record. I just wanted to make a video. This is so wrong to do that. Oh my god, this is gonna be like a big house, isn't it? Like, just really big. I think so. But, as I'm talking, I did want to bring up, we are almost to a thousand subscribers. I just wanted to, like, I really wanted to mention that. We're almost there. Now, exactly how close, as of recording, I just want, like, I want to point that out for anyone in the future, like, later on, just currently. And if it changes, who knows. But as of the current moment, it is at 950. Uh, I, I wouldn't say ha it's not technically halfway, but, you know, 50 is yeah, like half of 100. So just 50 more. We, we've, we've come a long way. I didn't know if this was going to be possible, and I feel like I hit lightning in a bottle just because of that. Because, I gotta say, if this game hadn't, uh, been made, if they didn't come up with LEGO Fortnite, I don't think I'd have much of what I do now. I don't think I'd be in the situation I'm in. Like, I, I probably wouldn't even be making videos at the moment. There's no telling what I'd be doing. But I am glad that y'all want to see my videos and, you know, w want more. And, you know... I don't know what kind of games y'all want to see. I've got I've got uh, a couple games, but it's all it, like it, it all depends on what y'all might want to see. You know, I I could go back to doing some of my old videos of like you know Fallout Shelter, Minecraft Dungeons Legends, both like both. I wasn't miss uh, I didn't misspeak. Like I have both versions or both games. I used to think that game was the same, and that was wrong. <sighs> but no, I've got plenty of games that I can do and show show y'all. I just want to have fun and show y'all some fun fun videos while I can. Because there's no telling if YouTube ever dies down. Like I, you know how everything becomes like kind of a, I wouldn't say a hype train, but you know YouTube's been a thing for a long time, and I don't know if anything's ever gonna. Uh, cause it to go away. Like, okay, for a good reference, something like Vaughn, which was a very old, like, which was, like, years ago, and then, I think right before that, that like, right after that was TikTok, and I think TikTok outbeat Vaughn, I, I think. But stuff like that, so I don't know if anything's ever gonna beat out YouTube. Who knows? Probably not, just because of how, um, how popular YouTube is, just so people can have some entertainment. So I could I could see YouTube lasting forever, not maybe not forever, forever, but I mean until technology catches up in a new way, and who knows? But I mean, oddly enough, I found myself rambling on more than I ever decided I would. I didn't even realize I I I've been told I ramble, and I see it now. I and. I just spill nonsense. It's it's just utter nonsense. But you know what? Sometimes we all just need a little bit of utter nonsense. Now we are down to just stage thirty-six. We are almost like we're almost done. I think it's gonna look good. We'll see. And I'm hungry again. I get hungry so fast. Why? I I, I didn't even. Do a lot. You are... Whoa, now. You are getting real close. 
please do not do not smite me I'm watching you I hope you know that you are on my bucket list of things I must conquer which we will one day just hopefully not today we can be friends if I'm actually wait a minute I think if I'm not careful that thing will destroy my build if it starts, if it starts like fight, if, it, if I alert it, I may have to run away from my build, or I may have to actually fight it. Okay, no, you are full on going for it. Oh, you've got to be kidding! Oh, you've got to be joking! You did this on purpose. I manifested this. Dad, gum it. Back up, back up. Maybe I don't have to fight it. Maybe I don't have to fight it. This is like... How would I describe it? No, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, whew. I was ready to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with it. I was ready to lace up my boots and get to work. I was ready to just... Yeah, that's right. You know who's big and bad. Me. I'm big and bad. And I'm the I'm the Lego, so you better watch out, or I'm a let go crazy on you. <laughs> Lego crazy on your stupid. Never mind. Nah, I shouldn't say that. You know, I've wondered if I want to keep my channel as a PG or maybe a PG thirteen channel. I've thought about it. You know, I kind of feel like I want to just to. Well, it's not like I have to. Yeah, it's just kind of more natural for me. So no, who knows, you know? We'll see what happens. The channel could change over time. Anything's possible. Okay. I don't even know what stage we're on. 40, 47. All I'm saying is this better be worth it. I mean, I spent, I spent money on this, dang it. Uh, that's the window. Okay. Now I gotta say, I think out of the worst ones, I'm gonna. Sp I, I think I might say the beach pavilion, due to one thing, and I think it's just based on me placing it out of the water. So again, it might just be because of me that I may have caused the problem. I am the problem. Hi, it's me. I yeah. I I definitely think where I placed it was the wrong idea. I should have placed it just on the land. That might have worked out a lot better. We'll, we'll, we'll see. It all depends. Oh, we done? Hey, we finished the beach house. Okay, it's look. it looks good. Man, I still can't mantle. Imagine if I could. Oh, you've got to be joking. You've got to be joking. We end this episode off on the lightning storm. That was going to be how the episode started, and I got lucky on how I... Oh my god. Dang it. Okay, well, this was... Poorly timed. Oh, okay. Well, as we're doing this, I do want to make sure I have my... My hanging fish... I kind of want it in between. Oh, that's not going to work. What the heck? Uh, why? I swear, I'm getting attacked by lightning everywhere. That don't work. Dang it! I don't have a proper place for my fish. Hold on, I think we might have a place. Oh, I gotta go one. Are you are you serious? I took damage from that. Are you serious? Also, I'm gonna put the fish here. 
I like it. Also, what the heck? I took damage in a lightning storm inside a house. So for everyone wondering, you are not safe in your build. You are not safe whatsoever. Oh boy. I can start placing stuff like this though. Oh, what the heck? Why is the... what? Is that center? That might be center. I'm just waiting for the lightning to calm down. Please. Ooh, I could put the surfboard somewhere. I don't know. I may just have to do this in my own time. I still gotta rate the builds. <sighs> Leave me alone, skeleton. Don't you realize we're in a storm right now? <sighs> I got, I hate this. I hate the weather in this game. You can't even, you can't even change a setting for it to fix it. Like there is no setting for that. So unfortunately, I'm gonna have to get my rating while inside the build, and while it's lightning. So to give a rating on each one out of just ten, you know, the base. I like the beach pavilion, it works, but it's not like, you know, it has to have a point A and point B from where, like, because it, obviously it has to look like it's leading somewhere, and if I did this right, oh, I could, if I wanted to, I could probably put a beach pavilion in, in a river, like a, you know, like an actual river, and have the middle section go over the water, like a bridge, so I can, I could turn that into a bridge if I did that right, so that, that could work for that. But as far as basic placement, that does not really work. So I'm giving it a 5 out of 10. It's good, but it's also kind of eh. Uh, shore Shack, it's simple, basic. You could put maybe a station or some chest in there. It's all right. It's not, it's nothing too grand, but you know, I wouldn't, you know, it wouldn't be the first build I'm on, but I'm giving that, I'm giving that a 4 out of 10. Hideaway, it's a nice simple house. You can find this on the main uh, Battle Royale Island currently. I'm pretty sure. Because I went there like a few games ago. But this one works. I'm giving this one a 7 out of 10. It's a nice, decent... Like, you can still make a nice little living in there. It has the you know, staircase out into wherever you want it to go. So it works. Lifeguard Tower, mainly just for more like looks. It's basically more for looks. Which I don't hate. Plus, you kind of get a nice view of the water, depending on where you're uh, placed, like where you're placed at. So I'd give that one a six out of ten, just because you can't really live in that. Now the swimming shop, I like it because it has like the the basement room and then like the upper, like the the top room, and you can have either like a a living situation there and also like have some decorum. And it, it's, it looks very nice. I'm giving that one an 8 out of 10. Little Beach House. Same situation, but more room. And, you know, you can have... Just... It's a lot bigger. I'll give that one a 9 out of 10. Because I, I like that one. And Beach House, the one we just built. As big as it is, it's, it's not bad. You can put a lot of stuff in there. Like, living situations, stations, decorum. Like... Literally, it's probably one of the best houses on here. I'm giving that one a 10 out of 10. That may might be personal bias. But I still think the Dirt Burger restaurants are the best builds, period. Like, I think this one's going to be my favorite set of builds. And then, you know, Pleasant Park. So if we put in order Dirt Burger, Pleasant Park, Beachside, Log Cabins, Fishing Docks, uh, probably the Shogun places when I get those from the Frost Biome. Then the majestic manners, and then you know basic shacks. So that's that's technically my order of things, but it was it's an it was an interesting one for sure. And I like how we no longer have to deal with the lightning, so I'm grateful for that. But hopefully you all enjoyed this video. If you all want to see more videos like this, let me know down in the comments below. Make sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. 
Make sure to share this with your friends, share this with your family, share this with whoever. Make sure notifications are turned on so you never miss any one of my videos when they go up. Also, if you want to see these videos early and feel like becoming a member, y'all go check out the join button on my channel. Help the channel by getting over to a thousand subscribers and more, and I will see y'all in the next one. So, with all of that being said, thank y'all so much for watching this video, and have a great day.